If you're someone who has digital download type products and you have courses in Kajabi and you're trying to figure out how do I do a bunch of digital downloads without running out of product space, this video is going to be for you today. Today, I'm gonna to walk you through how I am selling my templates in Kajabi under a single product. And so this is gonna be able to walk you through step-by-step step how I'm doing this um, and what you need to get to be able to do this. I will preface this by if your business is based on just digital downloads, so templates, workbooks, uh, anything like that, and you don't actually have courses or anything like that built in, I would really suggest for you moving away from Kajabi, um, or if you haven't gotten started on Kajabi, to go into something like uh, Etsy or Shopify or um, Teachable or something like that um, so that you're not because Kajabi really isn't the best place. There is a product limit, um, three on the lowest plan, 15 on the largest plan. So if you're not using it for that course environment, which I love it for its course environment, then you probably don't want to just get into Kajabi and use this system for that. If you already have your courses though, and you're like, I already pay for Kajabi, I just wanna use Kajabi to sell my templates, this is what's going to be helpful for you. So I will preface this, that if your um, members are often using the Kajabi app, you don't want to do it this way um, because the custom coding that allows you to do this would not hold true through with the app. So what I'm actually using is a template um, that was created by another uh, member of Kajabi. And so if you use the link in the description below, you're going to be able to um, download this template. So this is called the Unlocked Club and there's multiple different templates available in here. And so there's a membership template that you can join and this will give you 50% off basically all of the products in here. But what you wanna do is come down to this um, product unlocked momentum. And so this is the theme I'm specifically working with. You could also, if you really love the premiere theme over the momentum theme, you can use the premiere theme, but I find that this really works best um, typically with the momentum theme. So you'd want to get this product and purchase it. Once you have that, you can upload it into your Kajabi for whatever your product you're working on. And so she has really good videos in there showing you how to do all of this, but it's just as simple as downloading an export file or downloading a zip file and then directly uploading that zip file in. So I'm gonna show you where I'm using this template. So under my products and my templates is where I'm using this. So if I come in here, you can see that I have several different templates that, I, that I'm that i using. And so if I go into customize, this is where I would upload a theme. So once you've uh, purchased the template, you download it, you just come in here and click upload theme, and then you're just gonna drag and drop that zip file in, and then it will upload all of it into Kajabi. So here's the template that I'm using. So I'm gonna go and preview this to show you what this looks like. So this image up here, I obviously uploaded in, it matches what I'm actually doing. There's the portal, so you can change all of this in here. I give people who buy my templates, I give them a um, discount for both of my course products as well. So then we can, um, you can see here, I have this category up here and I have two templates within it. So I have a literature organization template and a task management template. And when they come in here, they're going to see if they haven't offered or they haven't bought this specific template, they're going to be able to click here to buy that template. They're not going to be able to access the actual videos within it or access any of that stuff within it in a web browser. And so if they go into the task management template, um, it's going to be the same thing. So if they bought this by doing the task management template, then they would be able to only have access to that um, and they wouldn't be able to access the literature organization template that has the URLs and everything to be able to copy in there. So that is what it would look like from your buyer standpoint. So this is a little bit better than just having a ghost offer that then goes to a page because it's gonna force them to create an account and everything, but then they're not going to be able to use that account for anything because there's no product within it. So once you have this, um, they can then, obviously, and you can change most of the things within here. Um, all of this um, 
colors and everything. There's a lot of different options available and she has great tutorials on it whenever she's working through it. But I do want to show you how I'm actually doing this within my offers um, because it's not something she talked about as much. And so you can see here that uh, next to each of these things, there's an open and close bracket with a number. And so that number is the offer number that should unlock this um, folder for access. So how you would want to go about doing this is once you've created your template, this also gives you the ability to like have videos walking them through how to use the template. So once you've created all of that, you're going to go into your sales and your offers. And so you can have um, everything uploaded into your single product um, with basically having a category or subcategory for each offer that you're actually wanting to do. And so I'm going to bring you into um, one of the offers that I've already done. So click in here. <clears throat> so this is one of the offers that leads you to that first um, template available in it. So you wanna make sure that you have the overall product in, um, if you just include the phrasing within the individual offers to unlock it, they won't actually get access to the product itself. So in here, you'd want to have the products in this offer and have that. Um, you can again control everything like you can do in um, general offers. So I'll leave a video above talking about how to do your Kajabi offers. So you can have this in here and then um, you would wanna have that template in here. And then when you look up here, this is going to be this uh, number up here in your URL, that's gonna be the number you wanna use within that product template. So if I go back into products and into my templates, you can see that there is the number there that I'm using um, to be able to unlock access. So when someone purchases that um, offer for the literature organization template, they're going to get access to this templates product. And then because that specific offer, they're going to get access to the literature organization template. So I'm gonna show you what this looks like from your customer's end. So here's what your customer would see. I've obviously granted myself this uh, product. Um, so if you go, then you'll see right here are my Notion templates and I can expand this. And so I have the literature organization template here and the task management notion template. This specific one has only gained access to the task management notion template. So if I set this up, I can easily click on any of these things and be able to go in and watch it. So if I click this, it's going to take me into here and I can watch it and have access to it. But I can see that I have a literature organization template, but I'm not gonna be able to access it. So if I try and click on these things, it's not gonna do anything. If I click here to buy, it's going to take me to the offer that is set up for this. So that is how you can, it's basically like advertising as well. Um, so you can take it to the offer that's set up for it. And then obviously, yeah, again, if I want to do this one, I'm not gonna be able to click the download templates. I would have to hit click, click here to buy. And it's again, going to take me to um, that offer page. So this allows you to use a single product for as many templates as you want. And then you can just basically come in here and you can also have the videos to go along with it. You can have things in the description and those downloadable files. And so if you're working on trying to, you want some digital download products, but you don't wanna waste a whole product on it. Um, this is what I would suggest for you is to get this template, upload it in, and then just create it how you want set it up so that people can only access the specific template that they purchased. If you haven't gotten started with Kajabi yet and you're really interested in it and wanna try it out for yourself, you can get a 30 day free trial using my link below to try it out, get accustomed to it, and even start making money on Kajabi while you're still in the trial period. I hope you enjoyed this video and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.